Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Web Dev. Now we understood about the constructor function, right? So now we have a clear understanding about the constructor function, how to create a constructor function, and these are all the things we have we understood a clear thing. So then now we need to know another concept that then what is a new keyword then here? So here we understood about a constructor function and it creates an object. Then what is the use of this new keyword? So what is this new keyword exactly? So we need to have, we need to understand about this one. Basically, the new keyword does a few things for us. Okay, whenever you are using a new constructor function like this, so this creates a, this does a new uh, few things for us. So whenever you use this one, so the first step what it will try to do is, so here, whenever you use a new keyword before a function, first it creates the empty object and assigns to this and assigns it to this. Okay, it creates first it creates the empty object and it assigns it to this. So now second one is assigns the properties. So whatever the properties are there to this. And the last one is it returns the this object. So that's it. These are the three things it will do. So here creating an object is nothing but so this is equal to empty object it will create. And here afterwards it will create so like this. This is equal to so this dot name is equal to Leela. Leela and also this dot admin is equal to false. Like this it will create. And afterwards it will return this. So this is the this is how what it will happen so when you use the new keyword. So this is what this is the new keyword. Whenever you are using a new keyword to a function means so what will happen is it creates an empty object and assigns that one to the this and assigns the properties whatever the properties you are trying to create it will assign it to the this and it will return the this object. So now what can I say is it is something like creating an object literal only but we are making use of this this. So now the next question immediately what you will get is what happens if you don't use the new keyword. So for a function for example let's say that if I don't use a new keyword then what will happen. So this is also one of the doubt you may be having right. For example let's say that I am having this one. So let's say that I am having a function member. Okay. So I need to pass a username for this one. Let's say you. So this dot name is equal to username and this dot admin is equal to false. So I'm having this one. So I am trying to do the this. So this means nothing but an empty object and it will assign all the properties to this object, right? So this. Now let user one is equal to new member of Leela. I'm using creating this one. And now let's try to console.log or otherwise. So we have created a new right. So let's create. So let's save it. Let's run here like this. So now when I am trying to create here, so the this, so here whatever the this is there, right? It is referring to the name Leela and false. So that means this is an object and it will create it. Fine. Now if you don't use a constructor function, okay? If I don't use a constructor function, so now we have used this new operator and that is the reason this has been created as a new empty object and all those things. Now if I don't use a new object, new, so then what will happen? Let's try to see. So I'm not using the new and creating a member of Lila. So that means I'm just calling the function member. Then let's try to run it. What will happen? See, it is having some global variable. This is referring, it is not referring to a variable and it is referring to a some global thing. So what is this global? So here we are running the node thing, right? So this is different. Let's try to run the same thing in the browser. As we are dealing with the browser, let's try to run it. So it is going to the parent scope global. So now if I try to take this function and if I try to run it, so here we are having the member function, right? Now I will try to call this member function with Leela. Okay. Now if I try to click here, so now here what it is written? It is written that this. If I try to do new member of Leela, so here it is written an object. Okay, member, member like this, it is written an object. But whereas if I try to run here, 
without using the new operator it is returning a window object so what will happen is so you are having a function right so the function we have seen it right so when you call this function without a new operator that this refers to the parent scope okay it, it refers to the global scope here in this browser the global scope is nothing but a window so that is the reason so it is having the window so now if i try to access the same thing okay if i try to access the same thing let user1 is equal to member of leela so if i try to use it okay user one dot name if i try to use it i am getting an not defined let user two is equal to new member of leela so here i, I will try to access the leela and if i try to access the user two dot name it is working whereas user one dot name is not working so where does this user one has been went so let user one is equal to i will try to call it again member of leela so where are these all went so these all went into the window so here that means there is nothing but what i can say is name will be available here window dot name so the, the this refers to the window here this time so there that this refers to the empty object and this empty object has been assigned to the user too but here that this refers to the window and here the window dot another one is admin so here it has been added into the window so that is the main thing the, when we are not using the new operator so that means you are polluting the global scope variable the window variable you are polluting it so if you don't use a new variable and you are using the functions means so you are trying to pollute so that this refers to the window function okay so this is the main thing so that is the reason it is always a good practice to add the new keyboard for every function okay so is there any ways uh, is there any ways to restrict the usage of this one so for example if you want to call a function member so is there any way to restrict the user not to call the function without new so is there any way miss yeah, yeah exactly there are two solutions available so that we can restrict the user for example let's say that if i am call if i am trying to call xml http request i am trying to call this one like this as a function but you are getting an exception or otherwise you are getting an error that failed to construct you cannot call this one please call this one use a new operator so how come this one is string so that means when i am trying to call member of leela so here also i instead of calling like this i need to throw an error like this so please use the, the new operator like this member so how can i how can i do this one so there are uh, obviously there are available so i will try to explain you in the next video how we can do this one all so this is the main usage of this new keyboard so whenever you are using a new keyboard for a function means the constructor function means it will create a new empty object and it will assign it to the this whereas you are if you are creating without a new op, new op keyboard means then it will be accessed with a global scope so this is the main difference between this one if you hope you understood about the concept if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you